Hey guys, Everything Tech Pro here. Today in this video, I'm going to be doing a speed test comparison between the Mac OS Sierra Public Beta 1 and Mac OS Sierra Public Beta 2. So, this was basically asked from a fellow YouTuber in the comment section. He wanted to know how fast is the Mac OS Sierra Public Beta 2 as compared to the Mac OS Sierra Public Beta 1. So, let's get started up right away. So, over here we're going to be using two tools to measure it. One is the Blackmagic. Uh, benchmark and the NOAA benchmark test. The disk speed test verifies the uh, speed test of the disk and uh, the other one, you know, the uh, NOAA, uh, NOAA bench benchmark test gives the complete benchmark test of the system. So, going on with the uh, speed test of the NOAA benchmark and I'm currently running the iOS, oh not iOS, the macOS Sierra Public Beta 2 right about now we're gonna be seeing, yeah, macOS Sierra Public Beta 2 16A254G, which is the public beta 2. So let's run the benchmark test right away. So I'm running the benchmark test right now, and both of them I'll run simultaneously. And then when I'm done with it, I'll let you know after the results are coming. I'm just starting both of them. So continue, and it's doing it. So I'll be back after the test is over. So, guys, <clears throat> back after the benchmark test. So the uh, NOAA benchmark gave me a benchmark score of 530 as you can see I have renamed it as Sierra PB2 which stands for Sierra Public Beta 2 so uh, the uh, <clears throat> RAM score is 124 a CPU test is 335 the graphics test give 28 and the hard drive hardware test give 43 so about the hard drive and other uh, things which is there on the uh, Mac so the disk test <clears throat> gave me a write speed of 413.9 megabytes per second and the read speed is 446.6 megabytes per second so quite a speed and I don't know why but for some strange reason after the test is over these areas are you know marked with X's I don't know uh, why whether the system does not support it or something else but this is the final score now so now uh, I'll be back in a second just switching to the other system because I cannot downgrade it to Mac OS Sierra Public Beta 1 from this system but I have already installed uh, the Mac OS Sierra Public Beta 1 in a system and didn't upgrade it right now so switching the systems and I'll be back in a moment so guys back with other system uh, you could notice that uh, all the uh, specs are the same both of them MacBook Air 2012 model both with the Intel i5 at uh, 100 <coughs> uh, 1800 megahertz and 4 gigabytes of RAM DDR3 RAM at 1600 megahertz and Intel HD graphics 4000 both have the same specs same uh, disk uh, speed and both of them are of the same model completely the same no change at all so this is running the uh, Mac OS Sierra public beta 1 you can see the Siri right here and <clears throat> let's start the benchmark test in this uh, Mac OS Sierra public beta 1 and let's see how it performs and continue and here so it has started so guys, uh, same procedures, it takes up a lot of time, so I'll be back after the test is over. So guys, back with the results again, and this is for the Mac OS Sierra Public Beta 1. So the NOAA benchmark gave me a score of 518, which includes the uh, RAM score of 119, CPU score of 333, graphics score of 25, and the hard drive and other hardware tests gave a score of 41 concluding to the final score of 518 then coming up to the disk speed test same thing you can see uh, both of them uh, here also you see some X's right here <coughs> and I still renamed both of them as Sierra PV1 public beta 1 so <coughs> so the final write speed is 391 megabytes per second and the read speed finally is for the 6.1 megabytes per second so uh, this is the score for the Mac OS Sierra public beta 1 so now uh, I'll be back I'll just copy all the stuff from the other computer to do this one to the main one and then we'll be analyzing it parallelly what increased and what decreased and in-depth analysis of both the speed test just wait for a couple of seconds I'll be back so guys now back with the parallel analyzing of both the uh, public betas parallelly so this one is the NOAA benchmark test and 
The one on the left is the macOS Sierra Public Beta 2. The name says it all. And the one on the right is the uh, Sierra Public Beta 1. So, <clears throat> not much of a change, but the uh, final score for Public Beta 2 was 530. And the Sierra Public Beta 1 final score is 518. So, all things are same. And uh, RAM right here is 124 and 119. So, the RAM speed is 5894 megabytes per second. Here it's 4928 megabytes per second. The RAM is a bit slower. Same thing, you know, uh, with every new uh, software release, Apple optimizes its software so your system basically runs faster and better. So, CPU tests 335 and 333. For floating points operations, give this one. There's two hues to read it, but definitely I could say here it's 74 or it's 59. So, that's the change right here. And the integer operations, etc., is 209. 887 to your, you could see that here it is 88, here it is 68, that's the change here. And MD5 hashes calculated is 85,000 and there it's 80,000. That's a big jump. So that gave the jump in the thing. But the the overall CPU test score is not much more. This is 130, uh, 335 and that is 333. So, and then the graphic score here it gave 28 and here it gave 25. The 3D frames per second is 67 right here, is 61 here. Hardware test gave 43 here, 41 there. So both of them you could see same hard drive capacity, 232 gigabytes, and drive write speed is 184 uh, Mbps, and here it's 176. So this also you know verifies the uh, speed test of the disk, which I'm about to show you right now. So now for now, I could say that Mac OS Sierra Public Beta 2 is the clear winner with the uh, benchmark score of 530. So Definitely Apple has made some changes. So let's close these guys and come back to the disk test. So so there you don't have this facility. So I had to take a screenshot of uh, both of them. So the one on the left is not public beta 1. The name says it. And on the right is the public beta 2. So uh, clearly you could say that uh, the uh, disk write speed of the public beta 1 is 391. Here it's 413. A big jump from uh, for about, you know, you could say... Uh, 20 megabytes per second more write speed we are getting in the Sierra Public Beta 2. And the read speed, very close, not much of a difference, 446.1 and 446.6. So not much of a difference, but the read speed is, you know, equally good. Now, seeing the individual scores, I could say that here you could see there are just slight jump in scores. 389, 92, 94, 422. Wow, the read speed is better here in the uh, Sierra Public Beta 1 compared to the Sierra Public Beta 2. I don't know why, but the read speed, even though this is finally more, but these are the individual scores. You can have a look. Various formats, PAL and TSC 720, uh, 1080-2K, and this, both of them didn't show. Then this is for the 10-bit RGB. These are the scores, and the 12-bit RGB, these are the scores. So finally, from here also, you could say, individually not seeing but finally, if you see, the Sierra Public Beta 2 is the clear winner right here also because the write speed has jumped about 10 megabytes per second and the read speed have also increased about uh, 0.5 megabytes per second. So uh, the Sierra Public Beta 2 is faster as compared to the Sierra Public Beta 1 and I have noticed that most of the glitches have been fixed which includes the Safari crash glitch and I think that was not a fluke and this is still persisting. Yeah, now you can see Safari didn't crash. So basically now uh, you can see that the Sierra Public Beta 2 is a more stable version. It's more faster. It's good in disk write speed test. So my conclusion, if you're in Sierra Public Beta 1, please do upgrade it to Sierra Public Beta 2. So that's it guys for today. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please like and subscribe to this channel to see more of these videos. So that's it guys for today. I'll see you in the next video. Until next time, it's peace out.